I'm heading back to Big Lots for another little haul with some really good stuff. So check it out. Hey guys, it's Amanda. Welcome back to Local Love Dark Edition. <laughs> Sorry guys, everything ran a little late today. So yeah, it's dark. But at any rate, hopefully you guys can see me pretty well. Welcome back to Local Love. If this is your first time here, welcome to the family. We love when you guys visit and we hope that you'll stick around. Maybe go ahead and, you know, subscribe. It's free. And if you like what we're doing, give us a thumbs up. What do we do? Great question. We do all kinds of things. We do food reviews. We do unboxings. We do crazy hair times. Look at that thing. And sometimes we just go to cool places and we take you guys with us. So, well, what are we up to today? Today we got us a little big lot haul. And uh, yeah, let's see what you guys think. Maybe a little bit of fall, maybe a little bit of Christmas. Well, let's start off with something. What I think of it, when I think of Christmas is these. And it's very classic. But with this one, they've made it very fall. So we've got the Danish butter cookies. And these say got milk. I love that and they made it very fall and autumn as you can see now i don't know if any of you've ever had these cookies before but let me just tell you Ooh, they are so delicious they're especially good when if i can if, when and if you can open them for one um no they're especially good when you have coffee oh these are like the perfect cookies to dip your coffee in i don't know if i can get them open Hmm. At any rate, these were on sale right now. So I was like, I'm going to get them because they were fall themed. They did have like the Christmas tins as well. But I thought this one was kind of unique and different. And I'm struggling. Oh. On top of that, music just kicked in. All right. I don't know what's going on. But very, very odd. Okay. I think we found an edge here. We weren't planning to have an issue. He's part way. All right. All right, I think I got it. So let's open these up and just kind of give you guys a little view of what you would expect. These, if you've ever had these cookies, should look somewhat familiar. So look at those, all glistening and delicious. I personally like these ones shaped like a pretzel. I mean, they all taste the same, exact same. Don't know why I like these the most, but these are butter, they're Danish butter cookies. And they, to me, just scream Christmas. Never thought about fall, but, huh. Mm. They're also my mom's favorite. So she's gonna be stoked to see that we have this for coffee in the morning. Hmm. Pretty happy about that. All right. Or with milk. <laughs> All right. something else that to me when I was a kid really screamed Christmas because we had this stuff every year it came in like a kind of a canister like a foil lined canister almost like a Pringles can but wider and it was just something that I just loved it is the deluxe filled Christmas candies if you guys have never had these they are amazing now, if you're not a hard candy person, it's not going to be for you. But these are filled ones, too. And yet again, it's going to be something that apparently I'm going to have trouble getting into. Why? Why me? Let's see if we can pop it open. Aha. Sometimes my brain is not just for holding my head open. Well, maybe. I didn't get it. I did feel it move. But it's not quite what I'd call open. I promise you guys, I'm not normally this this weak person. Boy, we are just having us a go today. I got it. I sacrificed my my teeth. All right, we got there. All right, so let's just see here if I can get a 
a shot of some of this, kind of get some of the light. It is dark out, so I apologize. I'll get some in my hand to show you guys. A few different options here. Maybe, maybe I will, maybe I won't. There we go. So they come in a different variety. I like these little raspberry ones myself. And inside there's a little filling. Yes, this tastes like my childhood. Mm. Very classic. And they did have different ones. They had the ones that weren't filled. And they also had little candy ribbon ones as well. So if you're in the mood for that for Christmas, I know we're a little early. Something to think about. I did also get these, mostly because they were on sale. But if you haven't had these, I still recommend them, Christmas, fall, whatever. This is the uh, Werther's Hard Candy with the green apple filling. We did do a video on this in our one of our other big lot hauls. All right, guys, so this is more my mom's thing and not so much mine, but I thought I'd share it with you guys anyway. This is the Peeps Snowmen. They also have Christmas trees, they were out. And they also have gingerbread men. So I'm excited. Sorry if it keeps dimming, guys. Um, so I'm excited to see if these taste any different than uh, the normal peeps like you get at Easter. Put this aside. We don't want our peeps to be tainted. All right. So, so let's try these. These are three packs and they're about $1.29 a piece here at Big Lots. They did also have regular Peep Peeps that were peppermint with the chocolate on the bottom. Those are really good, but I think I reviewed those a while back. So I wanted to try something different. So I'm just gonna try one of each. Oh, you poor guy, he didn't get stamped very well. This is our snowman, <laughs> he's looking Mighty wonky, mighty wonky. It's not his fault. We're not gonna hold it against him. But he he's looking like he's been through it, you know? Alright, so let's try it. Yep, sugar. It's a beep. Meh. Just place tastes like pure sugar. Nothing special about that one. But I'm hoping, oh, this one says gingerbread flavored. So that I'm excited about. She may only get one of these, but if they're good. All right, let's try it. Maybe I can get it open. Bum, bum, bum. Can she do it? Hey, I got there. Those are hard. I'm having trouble with packages today. These guys have been through it too. Just wanna... Oh, he smells gingerbready. Look at him, he's pretty rough. He looks like he is running and screaming in terror. <laughs> mm. Wait, wait. Still heavily sugared, of course. It's slight very mild not bad mm -hmm. I'll save her this other one mm. they smell really lovely like a gingerbread man and it's slightly there but not enough to make me buy these again I'm not a peeps fan oh well they're not bad though. All right guys, so that was everything we got for our little haul. Wasn't a big haul, just a little bit of something. I wanted to try a couple little things and I figured some of their fall stuff would also be on sale too. So I did check, but uh, nothing crazy, nothing, nothing out of the ordinary. I will tell you this, if you saw my last Big Lots haul with the popcorn, they still have it. So if you thought that that was good, I didn't care for the candy corn one, but that pumpkin spice popcorn, amazing 
So you can still get it. And I think it's reduced now. So grab it while it's on sale. All right, everybody. At any rate, that's going to wrap up our little haul. Sorry that it's so dark and everything's kind of like, ooh. But uh, thank you guys for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed our little mini haul. And other than that, peace. We'll catch you in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe and share with all your friends. And hit that bell so you know when we have a new video.